Okay, fuck. Yeah, I'll, I'll make it, I'll make it. Okay, let's make a turn. All right, I'm good, I'm good. And I can go 60 here. Yeah, I hate when it's a green light and you have to like turn left, but the arrow is gone, you know, it ends. Then you have to let the oncoming cars pass. That's the worst. Like, I really wish that didn't exist. Because how I see it, a green light, you should have authority to go either way. It's stupid how if it's the light's green, you know, you can't even go. Like, like you know, if the arrow's gone, you can go, but you can't go until you let the other oncoming drivers pass. You have to yield, which is pretty stupid. But yeah, but anyway, so yeah, uh, it's Friday today. So yeah, very beautiful and yellow outside. You know, it's fall. There's a truck over there. There's this like black uh, smoke coming out of it. But yeah, so I'm on my way to the gym to work out. This is my second workout of the week. I, I worked out on a Tuesday. So yeah, now it's Friday. But yeah, like I'm just gonna do what I normally do every Friday. So yeah, I'll work out. Probably gonna order Domino's today for dinner. I'll get some pizza. O originally, I wanted to get McDonald's today for dinner, but pizza's like 50% off, so there's like a discount. So I'll probably get pizza. I don't know if I want to get like a fat, like fat, like uh, thick crust of pizza or a thin crust, which is like you know, with not a lot of crust. And I don't know what I'll do to the pizza. I might put like olives on it. Maybe like bacon, mushrooms, um, ham, chicken. I don't know, one of those options. I still haven't really thought about it. But yeah, but I mean, I don't know. Um, like, I, I basically, yeah, so this week was pretty crazy. I had my job interview for Best Buy. Sorry, my camera is blurry. I don't know why. There we go. Okay, I zoomed out. Now it's clear. But yeah, but I had my job interview for Best Buy. Um, it, it went okay. Um, yeah, the interviewer, you know, you guys saw my video when I was talking about my job interview. Yeah, the interview went all right. It wasn't that bad, way better than I thought it would. The questions were a little tricky, I guess, but I was able to answer them. But I don't know, they did say like, oh, we'll, we'll call you. You know, we'll reach out to you the same day of the interview that already happened. Or if not today, a Thursday the latest. Well, it's Friday. I did not hear back from them. They said they'll call me and they never did. So I'm assuming I didn't get hired. I don't know if it's because of my lack of experience. Maybe because I'm don't. i not good with electronics. Or maybe, maybe too many people are already, you know, they're already like, yeah, interviewed and... I don't know, someone might have taken the spot, I don't know, so, I don't know, I guess I'll just have to keep applying, and uh, I mean, I don't know about that MCI mass marketing job, like, because I was supposed to have an interview, but it's stupid because I was supposed to have the interview, like, way back in, like, September or whatever, but, you know, um, it, it was supposed to be on September 11th, but they never like reached out to me or you know they were supposed to but then they canceled it they're like oh how about for october 3rd like up to this point i don't even know if i want to attend that interview because it kind of sounds like a scam honestly you know something about it just feels weird and i don't know i, I don't really want to work from home job anymore i'd rather just do it in person honestly it's much better but yeah, I mean, I don't know. So that's kind of where I've been in lately, you know. And then uh, I, you guys know what happened already, how I had like my volunteer meeting where I went to downtown. I, you know, I had like an info session about volunteering. So they might email me either Monday or Tuesday and they'll see if help is needed. So there's a chance this Tuesday coming up, which is actually pretty soon because it's Friday right now. So in four days, uh, I might have to go volunteer. I'll be making food for homeless people. Um, and that's good, you know, it's a good deed I'm doing. I'm helping the homeless. And at the same time, uh, there's a chance that, you know, that can get me some experience too. 
So maybe if I want to become a social worker, you need that type of stuff, you know, even if you become something as simple as like a child care worker, youth care worker, uh, that type of stuff is required, you know, even simply like partaking in the community, volunteering, helping like homeless people, even helping kids, making them lunches. That's really good. I mean, I also did put in my resume that I, uh, I, I'm in charge of before and after school transportation by, you know, like driving my younger sister to school, for example. And that's good. So if you ever want to become like a youth care worker or even a social worker, that's kind of what I want to become, like a social worker, then, you know, you, you need that stuff for the most part. So yeah, that type of experience. So yeah. All right, I arrived, so I'm just gonna park my vehicle. Uh, let's just get a good parking spot. Amazon Prime, right over there. I wish I had a job for Amazon Prime, that'd be really cool. But yeah, Amazon Prime, it's easy. Cause like, sorry, I'm just waiting for the car to, so I could talk. But yeah, Amazon Prime, all you really need is a license. That's about it. Yeah, you do deliver packages, but it sounds fun. But unfortunately, like most of the workers are just immigrants who, you know, take those jobs. Or I don't know, maybe I could consider working at like an Amazon warehouse. That'd be pretty cool. Pretty good pay. Uh, I mean, I don't know if even Best Buy, for example, if they'll contact me or not, but... Yeah, I mean, I hope they do. I don't know. Probably not because they were supposed to do it Thursday, but the pay is good. Uh, he told me that you can actually get like 16 bucks an hour. So that's pretty good. And it, and uh, Best Buy, the cool thing about it, it's like very like kind of like I don't know how to describe it, but it's a job where they, they just want to have like a fun environment, if you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, it's pretty cool where you could like interact with people, have a good time. And you know, they're like pretty like laid back and chill. They're not like most jobs where you have to be really serious all the time. And Best Buy, um, it's pretty easy. There's merchandising, like stocking shelves. Um, they do have like, yeah, just something as simple as like, you know, greeting customers, you know, showing them where to go. Uh, but yeah, like putting electronics up on, you know, shelves and stuff like that, or even carrying a television, like a TV in the truck, uh, the truck and stuff like that. So yeah, it's a fun job and there's Home Depot over there. So, you know, if not, if I don't get hired for Best Buy, maybe I could try maybe applying to Home Depot. That'd be pretty nice. But yeah, but yeah, that's all I have to say, guys. You know, uh, I'm just going to go to the gym Got my workout, I'm going to go work out, and then I'll go swimming. Got my shampoo with me, all in my bag, everything. But yeah, I only have two more visits at the gym, so I'll, I'll buy ten more next week. I'll just use those last two visits. And yeah, then I'll buy them for like 120 bucks, so I can get like at least ten more visits. But yeah, because working out, you know, at least I'm doing something, you know. Getting out of the house, working out. But yeah, see you guys. I'll keep you posted, and yeah, bye.